Okay, my room's kind of a mess. As you see, there's a pile of stuff in here. Computer area is just, it needs work. But I've got my brand new bed. And here are the box springs for the king. So let's uh, see how this one man operation is going to work uh, in trying to open it. Looks like I'm going to need some kind of scissors or something to cut through. I'm going to try not to uh, rip the actual bed with this, but uh, let's give it a shot. So let's see if I can put this thing somewhere where it sees everything. I don't know if I have a spot. Um, let's see. Let's create a stand of some sort. Ah, take this, take that, and looks like it's kind of centered. Voila. I think that's doing it. Okay, so first is first. Let's get this up there. Now, I wish there was an arrow of some sort to tell me which way this thing's supposed to go. This thing's not like, it's like very heavy. This is a two man operation. I'm gonna probably hurt myself. That's okay. We're used to doing stupid shit like this. Okay. Oh. Uh, I noticed there's some black stuff on here. The shipper. That's alright. The box was kind of funky and messed up when it came. But. There's a big girl. Hopefully this thing unrolls to the right, so it's right side up. I, I have no clue. I'm going to attempt to... Is this filming still? Looks like it is. We're going to attempt to open that and see how it works. So... I've got the bed and it's packing material now on here so let's start cutting the plastic off all right and then we can see the great expansion i'm going to put this thing back up here again and right like that See if we can get it going. Okay. All right. So let's start cutting this plastic off. It's pretty tight to the material. Obviously, this thing is a. Uh, ready to expand. Ooh. Yeah. It's going before I even get it all off. on the wrong side. So I'm going to have to flip this pretty thin. You know, why would they... But I can hear this thing inflating as we're talking. It's pretty crazy. Look at that. I haven't even taken all the plastic off it yet. And you can see and hear the inflation process. Now the mattress undoes, uh, it starts to expand, but going the wrong way. It would have been nice had it expanded so I don't have to flip it. That's all right, we'll get it. Wow. So even with the first set of plastic on, uh, started paying. Comes with two pillows. 
This is a bed from Amazon. It's a gel foam mix. Got pretty high ratings. Uh, called Cool Gel Ultimate. So, I'm going to give you some comedy here. I'm going to try to flip this thing by myself. Because, as a male, I'm, I've got built-in impatience to wait for someone to help me with this. So, where's the, where did I put that scissors? I tossed it while I was trying to, trying to get this done. There's Good, this is lifted up a little bit so I can cut through here. Let's get these pillows out. They're kind of thin, but they got that same kind of gel feel. I already own some pillows, but two more times. So let's put those to the side. And yes, we have the dry cilia gel packs all over the place. These things, there's three, six, nine of them. Yeah. Well, I know I need, need a lot of those, but they got them. Okay, so let's cut this part. This thing has expanded quite a bit. Looks like it's already done. And I'm going to pull this plastic off. There's a king uh, replacing my old king that, that was warped all over the place. It was a spring bed. So this is my first gel foam bed. Uh, yeah, I'm taking a leap of faith, not even testing it, but they're going by user reviews that it was uh, supposed to be pretty remarkable. At 670 bucks, so I think it's a pretty good buy. Seeing how people buy sleep numbers for up to like four grand, I believe, or they're expensive. Uh, let's see. So far, so good. I got this bed flipped the wrong way, but we'll fix that in a minute. We're trying to fix that. Okay. So. Let's first of all see. Is this going to go this way? Yeah, it fits my box springs pretty well. Just like that. Okay, I'll put the logo on the outside right like that. Okay, so apparently I'm going to have to go with it. Now, if you remove this tag, it's illegal. I'm going to leave it on there. Oh, that is not light one bit. way to die. Plastic in our new section is helping it move a bit. I wish I can let it, well, if I let it fall, 
it'll hit that lamp, won't it? Yeah, we don't want to do that. So, let's try and miss it. No, I'll just trust it. This is completely a two man operation, and I am just kind of going for it. some uh, 25 year limited warranty information 25 years that should be around the rest of my life all right here we go all right well in this short amount of time it seems to be uh, pretty expanded. A little more plastic. It looks like it's fully expanded. They said it takes like 24 hours. And this is supposed to be a 12 inch mattress. Which it looks like it is. So let's take a quick reading on where it's at. Twelve inches. There's no 24 hours about it at all. Looks like it's 12 and a half actually. Right there. Uh, let's see. This side is more accurate. Yeah, this thing says 14 inches actually. It's definitely more than 12. So, uh, yeah, I got it to right about 13 and a half, 14, somewhere in there. Okay. As far as uh, smell, yeah, I do smell a chemical smell on it. It's different in different places. It doesn't smell that bad here. Over here, it seems pretty strong. Not that bad. No, it's not. It's not horrible. It's it doesn't smell that, that bad. Let's let's do the ultimate test now. Oh, far better than my other mattress. It's not soft. It's not hard. It's like a. It's like a perfect medium. I feel as if the only part that I'm sinking at a little bit is right around my shoulders. No, actually right around my waist, right right there a little bit. But not not really sinking, just uh just soaking in a little bit, just a, just about a half an inch down, a quarter inch maybe. Feels good. I got lucky at that. Um Let's try a test with something. Close that. And let's jump on the bed. Look at that. Didn't fall over. It's absorbing everything so that... Uh, you're not gonna wake up who's ever sleeping next to you if you're moving around a lot. I can tell because it's uh, independent. There's no springs on this. It's foam and gel. The first part of the gel would be probably about 
this thick right here, and then the rest I think is foam. So the gel margin is right there, and the rest is foam. Not as far as the way the mattress looks. It's the Cool Gel Ultimate. You can find it on Amazon. Uh, very nice. Let's take a look, see if there's any uh, defects, coloration problems. It's one of the things I read in some of the complaints, there was a tear. So let's go ahead and do an uh, inspection. As of right now, I don't see anything. No, looks perfect. about how even it is. <laughs> Looks great. No problems. Uh, well, let's do the edge test. We'll sit on the edge, see if it's, uh, that was another problem that all these gel beds seem to get is this edge test. Or if you sit on the edge, yeah, I mean, it, it, the edge collapses a little bit when you sit on it. Um, let's see if I'm lying next to it, if it's going to be a problem if I, not much of a problem if you're lying on it. Uh, if you're lying next to the edge, it's okay, boy, it's comfy, I like it. Uh, if you're sitting like this, your legs definitely drop. Let's see if I can get a good angle. Uh, the one thing about the spring beds is that they seem to have uh, a, lot of firmness along the side. These, these gel foam beds will do that a little bit. I don't know if I'm getting it, but you can see that it bends down right there. But I mean... I don't know, it doesn't seem like that's a problem. Uh, you might like the very firm, rigid edge. You're not going to get that in a gel foam bed. It's going to bend down a little bit. However, you will get a real nice feel as far as the way the bed feels. Bounces back, comes back nice. Yeah. No marks. Looks good. And that's it. That's the uh, Cool Gel Ultimate uh, from Amazon. Very highly rated, around close to $700. Uh, took a little longer in shipping than I wanted. Oh, the box. Uh just does not fit the bed that well it was ripped in half as you can see it came with this upper part and then the bottom part was just ripped in over here against the wall I stacked it but so you saw it basically like this two parts just the bed was standing in that and this was just over there so I don't know what happened I wasn't here as they delivered it but uh, the bed's fine, and luckily I didn't get any damage. The plastic that it comes in is two-layered plastic, and it's fairly thick. Uh, the first layer is this real thick stuff, and the second one is the far thinner plastic, and that's why it was able to expand uh, when I took the first layer off. But they said let, allow it to expand for 24 hours. This literally took uh, the length of the video. You saw it, and it was at a larger amount than the 12 inches advertised, at least mine, right when I measured it. So, you know, the real test is time. Let's see, uh, in 90 days, I'll post an update, complaints or whatever. But right now, as far as the instant feel and everything that I would get, like a showroom floor, I would have gotten it. So, uh, as of now, it's a great choice. We'll see. Take care.